Do you write prompts in ChatGPT like write an ad for my skincare product and then get disappointed because the output is useless? The problem is not ChatGPT, but the prompt you give. ChatGPT has to guess what the product is, what it does, and who it's for. But if you give this prompt, write a short, stylish Instagram ad copy for a skincare product called Glow Pure Serum. It's an organic face serum for women aged 18 to 35 with oily or acne-prone skin. It reduces acne and dark spots, is fragrance-free, cruelty-free, and dermatologist-tested. The tone should be confident, clean, and trendy, perfect for an Instagram audience. The output will be unique and great. I've added some advanced formulas in this prompt, which you will learn about later in the video. For now, let's start with the basics. In this video, I will teach you simple steps to write a powerful prompt that gives you the best results. By now, you understand what a prompt is and the difference between a bad and a good prompt. I will explain why a good prompt is important for any task through a story. Imagine you go to a restaurant and say, I want a burger. The waiter will bring any burger which may not be to your liking. But if you say, I'd like a grilled chicken burger with extra cheese, no onions, medium fries, and a Coke, the waiter will bring exactly what you ordered, which you will enjoy. Formula The formula I use in prompts is RTDF, Role, Task, Details, and Format. For example, you are a YouTube SEO expert. Suggest five viral video titles for a tech review channel targeting USA. Use bullet points. Here, you are a YouTube SEO expert is the role. Suggest five viral video titles is the task. For a tech review channel targeting USA is the detail. And use bullet points is the format. If you add these points in your prompt, you will get a better, more perfect output. The prompt I used at the start of the video is a bit advanced. Watch further to learn about it. Pro tips. Ask for variations like give me three variations to choose the best one. Add examples in the prompt to help ChatGPT understand the output you want. Mention your audience like beginners, college students, housewives, or office workers. Mention age groups like children 12 to 18 or adults 18 to 25. Mention gender like girls, boys, men, or women. If you add these points properly, I guarantee the output will be your best. Gift for you. Along with pro tips, I have a gift for you, a complete prompt package. The link is in the description below. You can use these prompts for your work. I included all kinds of prompts. Now, let's break down the prompt I used at the beginning of the video. I had added a few extra points myself to get the best possible results. In the prompt I wrote, Write a short, stylish Instagram ad copy, as in format and platform, for a skincare product called Glow Pure Serum, as in product name. It's an organic face serum, as in product type, designed for women aged 18 to 35 with oily or acne-prone skin, as in target audience. The serum reduces acne and dark spots, as in main benefits. It is fragrance-free, cruelty-free, and dermatologist-tested, as in special features. The tone should be confident, clean, and trendy, as in tone, perfect for an Instagram audience. And with the help of this prompt example, you can take your own prompts to the next level and make them even more advanced. I hope what I explained helps you improve your work. If you have doubts, comment and I will reply to each valuable comment. If you want a part two, comment as well. These skills will help you use ChatGPT smartly. If you liked the video, please like, subscribe, and share your best prompt or experience in the comments. See you in the next helpful video. Until then, stay smart, stay creative.